Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's Six Box Ultimate Hit Parade Football Mixer. Random Team 2. One spot gets you two. This is what's included in the mixer. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. When I do the randomizer for the uh, uh, for the Chase the Mantle spot, we'll use the original 16 names. Big thanks to everyone who bought spots straight up and then... Uh, you know, and then congrats again to the people who won their way in as well. All right, and there's all 32 teams. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Six and a two. Eight times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. We got Jimmy down to Adam. Six and a two, eight times for the teams. Two, three, four, five, six. And good luck, seven. And eighth and final time. After eight, we got the Falcons down to the Pittsburgh Steelers. All right, so here's how the randomizer shakes out for everybody. Jimmy, you got the Falcons, Jeremy with the Colts, Kieran with the Panthers, Mark with the Patriots, Simon with the Chargers, Nick Stober with the Titans, Adam Copperman with the Bengals. Jimmy, you got the Bang, uh, the Buccaneers, Adam with the Seahawks, Sean with the Cardinals, Thomas with the Bills, Adam with the Texans, Brett with the Jaguars, Sean with the Jets, Ryan, last spot, Mojo, Rams. Hui with the uh, Cowboys, Adam with the Niners, Ryan with the Eagles, Simon with the Ravens, Sean with the uh, Saints. Sean Keith with the Saints. Sean uh, Wainer, I would say, is uh, has the Browns. Sean W. with the Browns. Adam, Giants, Chiefs, Broncos. Hui with the Packers. Brett with the Raiders. Nick with the Mar uh, with the Marks. No, Nick with the Bears. Mark with the Dolphins. Thomas with the Vikings. Jeremy with the Lions. Kieran with the Commanders. And Adam with the Steelers. All right, let's alphabetize by team. We're going to pause the video, give you a little bit of a trade window while I go grab the boxes for this break. So be right back. All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. No deals were done, so TWC. Thanks everyone for getting in. We're gonna do the the cards first, and then we'll go through the three memorabilia here. Um, and put your thinking caps on. We'll play some Who Am I here. All right. Here's the first one. I'll give you some clues about the players and then we'll try to guess who the player is based on those clues. America's favorite game. What do you win? The glorious, glorious bragging rights. Nothing better than that. You can brag as much as you want, too. All right, that feels like a Beckett slab. It is. It's bang, Jalen Waddle. Rookie cap patch autographs. That's pretty cool. That's uh, 14 out of 25 from 2021 encased, and it's 9, 10. Dolphins? Mark with the Dolphins. All right, this is a Jaspi exclusive. Another graded card. This is a PSA slab. Good luck. It's going to be Brandon Ayuk. Rookie Brandon Ayuk. Nice. Two color patch. An autograph from NT. 9, 10. Out of 10 on the grade. Niners. Adam Copperman with the Niners. Good morning, Adam. Nice hit. He's on the East Coast. He's probably watching this in the morning. All right. Two spots left in the Judge Mixer. Nice. If we can sell out those two spots, I can cancel a filler and add another three spots back in, Bart and everybody else. That'll, that'll help that break fill a little bit faster because we've got multiple fillers to go. 
Nice. It's good to hear. All right, last of the trading cards. And it is, wow, nice Austin Eckler. Chargers Lightning Bolt. And you got some diamonds in there as well. It almost looks like, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's a one of one. Very nice. Chargers, that's going to be for Simon. Simon. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. We also have some flawless football in the store right now. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Um, same, same with the, uh, the Judge Mixer. If we can sell out some more full spots, I can cancel more fillers for that flawless. So we'll pivot to whatever helps make that break move a little bit more quickly. All right, let's do, there's too many helmets. One's just a regular one, and one specifically first rounders. And these are all the different certificates of authenticity they use. Helmet is not covered up, so. All right. We've got an active running back. Uh, who shares the name with a famous British explorer, cartographer, and naval officer, famous for his three voyages between 1768 and 1779 in the Pacific Ocean and to New Zealand and in Australia in particular. He died uh, in present day Hawaii, aged 50, leaving behind uh, a spouse and six children. Achieved the rank of captain in the, uh, the Royal Navy. So yeah. Uh, served in North America as a master aboard the fourth-rate Navy vessel, the HMS Pembroke, in the Seven Years' War in Canada. Made, made, made a lot of voyages. Botany Bay. You know, re returned, to, returned to England after a visit to modern-day, what is modern-day Indonesia. Cape of Good Hope arrived in St. Helena, back in England. Made a second voyage when he was the rank of commander. Where did he go here? Went all over the place. This guy was all over the place. You know, Hawaii, North America, returned to Hawaii. I think he died in Hawaii. There's some tensions amongst him and the, uh, the Hawaiian people, I think. But he, he went around the world and I, 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 I. Who am I? Uh, not Hall, not Bijan, not Dalvin Cook, but his player knows it, it has the same exact name as this English explorer. Yeah, this is all off the top of my head. All this info. Not Dalvin Cook, Jimmy, but come on. Jimmy, you got to get this one. Not Dalvin Cook, but Captain James Cook. That's where I was like, if James doesn't get this. There you go. Buffalo! That's going to go to Thomas and the Bills. Captain James Cook. Man, I wonder if they'll ever make, if they make James Cook football player, James Cook a captain, he'd be Captain James Cook. I'm not sure how well versed football player James Cook is on his British explorer, explorers in the 1700s history. But I don't know, with a name like James Cook, you would think that had to have come up at some point in, in high school, right? In history class. And they're like, yeah, James Cook. He's like, yeah. It's a British dude. Some, did some exploring. How's my name? 
You're a crook, Captain Hook. All right, next is a first rounder who does not share the name of a famous explorer, but he's a retired quarterback, 64 years old. A first round pick back in the day, pick 14 out of Miami. Was a USFL most valuable player, a USFL rookie of the year, a first team all pro, five time pro bowler, an NFL passing touchdowns leader, a passer rating leader, an NFL completion percentage leader, a pro football hall of famer. I ended my career uh, with uh, 2,874 completions. No, Marino didn't go to Miami. He played in Miami. 60.1% um, completion, career completion percentage. 237 touchdowns to 175 interceptions. 35,467 passing yards. And ended his career with an 84.4 passer rating. Not Doug Duke. Doug Flutie wishes he had these numbers. Doug Flutie wishes he was a Hall of Fame. I don't think Doug Flutie's a Hall of Famer. Right? Stood at 6'3", 217. Ironically, uh, this player was born in Pittsburgh, but went to Miami. Whereas Dan Marino went to Pittsburgh University, University of Pittsburgh, right? And then played in Miami. There's sort of a weird connection there. Uh, and their eras definitely overlap. Along with my teammates, Thurman Thomas and Bruce Smith, I am one of the only, uh, one of the only three players to have my number retired by the Buffalo Bills. Another Bill? Thomas, congrats. Yep, Nick's got it. Jim Kelly. Here's the silver ink autograph against the red helmet. You got two different helmets, so that's pretty cool. Nice. These mini helmets are pretty cute. All right. Now, grown up time. Those little mini helmets for kids, for babies. We're not babies. What are you, a baby? This is a diamond mini helmet, full-sized mini helmet. card, extra packing material. This is in a, a pouch. Jeremy proactively guessing Barry Sanders. Ray proactively guessing Jamar Chase. Neither of those players. But this player is a running back, an active running back, born in Savannah, Georgia, 29 years old, 5'9", 208. Went to UTEP for uh, a few seasons. Was a fifth round pick. Played for two teams my entire career, a one-time Pro Bowler, a one-time NFL rushing touchdowns co-leader. Current up to, uh, up to the end of last season, my current stats, 5,940 rushing yards. It's an average of five yards a carry, 45 rushing touchdowns, 272 receptions for 2,000 yards, and 18 receiving touchdowns. Um, what were my numbers last year? Play, only played 11 games last year, 656 yards, a couple touchdowns. 
but did start a couple games in the postseason. Had 226 yards total, three touchdowns. Yeah, much much better, uh, much better postseason. Yeah, he think he deal with some injuries. Yeah, Sportport, you got it. It's Aaron Jones, and that's going to be for Huit Nguyen with the Green Bay Packers. Nice big giant helmet here. Let's take a look. Boom. Big helmet. Nice autograph up there. Classic Green Bay Packer colors. This almost looks like an official helmet, right? It's pretty nice. There you go, Aaron Jones. And just, just for complete transparency inside the, the sticker inside the box right there also says Aaron Jones. I'm not just making it up. And there you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching and thanks for breaking with me. Now, let's give away, let's go back to the list. We're gonna give away a mantle entry. So remember, we're gonna use the original 16 spots. Let's roll it, randomize it 11 times, name on top after 11, gets an entry to chase the Mickey Mantle. Fingers crossed, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Good luck, everybody. Eleventh and final time. It's gonna be Jeremy Port. There you go, Sport Port. Congrats. You got an entry into the uh, into the big one, the big promo, the Mickey Mantle promo. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye bye.